Monday family just got done tanning and heading to the bank about to go home now and get some work done and I thought I would tell you guys that uh, when I redid my website about five six maybe seven weeks ago a lot of people took advantage of that new six-week jumpstart program but a lot of those programs are now coming to an end so I'm going to have room for a lot of new clients so if you guys are interested in taking advantage of that um, not just the six-week jumpstart program of but maybe like the 12 week transformation package. This uh, I also offer an 18 week package or the six month life change program. Um, all of those are available and all of those um, have room right now. So uh, if you guys are interested, head over to tregfisher.com or email me at tregfisherfitness at gmail.com. Both of those are in the description box below. And let me know, I'd love to work with you guys. I would love to help you get into the best shape of your life. It's my passion and I absolutely love it. So I'm um, about to head home now and get some work done. So I'll see you guys in the next clip. All right, guys. So sitting here, getting ready to go to the gym, watching uh, the online coach right now and going through some emails and messages that I got on Facebook. And I changed my Facebook profile picture yesterday to a picture of me in my Trek Fisher Fitness shirt. Now you guys have probably seen me wear this in a lot of my videos. I've had it for about a year and a half, but for some reason, when I changed my profile picture to that with my Trek Fisher Fitness shirt, tons of people started asking me if they can buy one or if I have them in stock or if I have them in my online store. And the answer to that is no, I don't. That was just a prototype that I made about a year and a half ago. And um, I wasn't totally happy with the way it looked. Um, it had the little guy on the front that was flexing. And then the font, I didn't think really matched um, the theme of the shirt that I kind of had going on. So I never did kind of put those into production and uh, actually run those and put them into my store. But... I can tell you guys, if you go to tregfisher.com, you see uh, that there is a little block that says official Treg Fisher Fitness shirts coming soon. And that's not false. So um, I'm working on some things right now, I'm working on some different designs. And um, when I'm happy with them, that's when uh, you guys will start to see them come out. So. Um, keep your eyes open for that. You guys on my YouTube channel will be the first ones to know because um, you guys are the reason that any of it would be possible anyway. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to kind of clear that up a little bit because I was getting some questions about that. The old Trek Fisher Fitness shirt that you saw, just a prototype, nothing uh, that's going to be put into stock, put into production. Maybe someday as kind of like a retro shirt, but right now I don't want to really put money into something I'm not 100% happy with in the first place. So, um, yeah, but drinking my pre-workout right now. Um, I've got a scoop of C4, just the regular C4, and then a half, more like a third of a can of the Monster Ultra Sunrise, and then three capsules of NO3. About to go to the gym, hit legs, and uh, I'll see you guys there. Alright guys, so having my last meal of the night and what it is is just one bag of Pop Secret Homestyle Popcorn. Now this popcorn is actually only 90 calories for the entire bowl and it's absolutely delicious. So if you guys want popcorn, if you guys like popcorn and you're cutting, this is a perfect snack where you're going to get some volume and it's hardly any calories. Also having a scoop of Alpha Aminos right here. And I know it's Monday night, which is my typical Marvel, Marvel Movie Mondays where I watch a Marvel movie, but I've almost ran out of all my Marvel movies that I have because I've been watching one every single Monday this entire summer. Um, I don't have Thor or Thor 2 
or The Avengers. So I'm kind of out of movies right now. And I don't know if you guys can see this. I'll zoom in real quick. But Joe Dirt 2 just came out on Crackle. It's exclusive to this, um, I guess it's like a video on demand um, website. And it just came out, and I am a huge fan of the first Joe Dirt. Judge me if you want, but that movie's hilarious. So, super excited for Joe Dirt 2. Going to watch that instead of Marvel Movie Monday. Um, but that'll pick up next week, because I am going to try to find Thor or Thor 2 um, in the next couple days. That way, I can watch that for next Monday. But, about to watch Joe Dirt 2 right now, and uh, head to bed after this. So, I'll see you guys in the next clip. I enjoy my job. Because if people have a hard week and they want to rock out at a concert, I like to help. You know, picking up their garbage, bodily fluids, just so they can relax. They can thank me later. They don't. But uh, that's cool. It don't stop me from being all in all the time. Bam, bam. You know how it is, yeah. You know, so much. Hey, what's up, family? It is Tuesday, July 21st. On my way to the gym right now, about to hit a push workout. Gonna be hitting chest and triceps today. Now, in that footage, the workout footage that you guys saw um, in a clip earlier in the video from my squat session yesterday, I had no energy. I was dead. My feel out set, my feel out weight that I talked about uh, in a video maybe a couple weeks ago, which is 275. 275 is my feel out weight where I'll kind of be able to gauge how my session's gonna go, how my entire workout's gonna be, how much energy I have. Uh, it was heavy. 275 felt heavy and I just feel worn out. So I figured that next week um, I would take, sorry there's a cop coming. Um, so I figured uh, next week I would take a deload because next week is our county fair here and I it's gonna sound super like redneck super like I live out in the country but I do live out in the country I grew up on a farm um, the how like my family we raise pigs so each year we take pigs to our county fair um, I did it for 10 years I was in 4-H for 10 years my sisters my two youngest sisters they are seven I think this is like their seventh year now so they will have pigs out at the fair and uh, I always try to go out there and help them with their projects as much as possible so I'll be spending time out there next week and um, I figured it would be a good time to take a deload since I'll probably not have as much free time next week since I'll be balancing time between um, online training trying to get my sessions in and then also spending time out at the fair with my family and helping my sisters so it just kind of kind of fell that way and I think it's a good way to kind of almost ease into my bulk so I'll take a deload and then I'll hit one more hard week before I do completely end my cut and start my bulk so I'm excited for everything that that is going to entail but uh, about to get this push workout done now going to gonna hit it as hard as I can um, we'll kind of see where I'm at not trying to set any PRs or anything just trying to um, get a little bit better, progress, and uh, continue on with this cut. So I'll see you guys in the next clip. All right, guys, so done. That's better. All right, guys, so done with that workout. And that was hands down the best chest workout I have had this entire summer. The pump was, to put it in perspective, the pump was so good today that it hurt. Every time I got to the top of the movement, every time I flexed, everything was just cramping up. And those are the workouts that I love. Um, the workouts that hurt, the workouts that you know you're getting better. Um, so what I did today that was a little bit different was I did not worry at all about the weight that I was pushing. I actually worked with some lighter weights today, but I focused solely on the squeeze and really flexing at the top of every single rep and man, it paid off. So next time you guys get in the gym, try that out. Try really just focusing on the squeeze and on the flex rather than the weight that you're pushing just for a little change of pace. And I guarantee you, you're gonna love it. So um, as soon as I got done with my workout, headed to Subway, 
uh, picked up a foot long on flatbread. I have egg whites and chicken breasts on there. And then I had to get gas. Gas was $2.49, so a lot cheaper than it's been all summer. It's kind of been hanging around the 260s all summer, so glad that it's now in the 240s. Hopefully it keeps going down. Um, and I always like asking you guys, what is the gas price where you guys are at? I'm always interested in uh, the gas prices kind of all around the world. So um, let me know down below, what, what is the gas price where you guys are from? But um, kind of rambling at this point, about to um, head home. I'll see you guys in the next clip. I'm gonna eat this Subway.